Three brothers joined. Three unicorns in company. Why did you decide to stick your nose in my affairs? You're the ones who forced me to come along. Uh, well, if you give me your scroll, you can get off my ship at the next port. You're lying, and this is not your ship. Ah, oh, so you met Haddock. Well, he isn't the captain anymore. He's what you might call a shipwreck. Haddock? The captain's name is Haddock! Come and fight! Stop squirming! You expect me to hold still? Stop right where you are! Where we can see Who do you work for, Alan? Who's your boss? Ah. Ah. This has got to end now. I know you're there. <laughs> Quit running, kid. Out of breath, old man. What? You cheeky! Why, the killer! Stop right where you oh, oh, oh. yes. You're gonna end up as hands where we can see them! Turn yourself in, Alan! And if I don't, you're gonna call the police? He got what was coming to him. <sighs> ah! Here's the second scroll. That's the scroll he stole from the Bird Brothers. And now I'm going to put things straight with that Captain Haddock. If there's some link between him and Sir Francis Haddock, there's a high chance he can help us. Three brothers. We know that there are three scrolls. Mine, the Bird Brothers. Let's think, Snowy. I don't know who Alan works for, but I'm willing to bet he's got the third scroll. Captain, are you the descendant of Sir Francis Haddock? Captain of the triple-masted unicorn under King Charles II. Huh? Who are you again? My name is Tintin. I'm a reporter. 
I have in my possession two scrolls handwritten by the very same Sir Francis Haddock. I'm in search of treasure. The long lost treasure of the unicorn. That's enough! I don't want to talk about all that! Alan! Alan is a bandit. He's double-crossed you so he can take command of your ship. And you know it. I'm going to have you put in irons! Oh, 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 ah! oh. <sighs> Captain, <sighs> I can help you. As much as you can help me. Just tell me what you know. It is the year 1676. The Unicorn, a valiant ship of King Charles II's fleet, has left Barbados in the West Indies and set sail for Europe. The captain is indeed my ancestor, Sir Francis Haddock, to my great misfortune. Two days at sea, a good stiff breeze, and the Unicorn is reaching on the starboard tack. Suddenly, there's a hail aloft from the crow's nest. Sail on the port bow! <sighs> the Jolly Roger. Pirates. Worse. Red Rackham. The wind's in their favor. We've got to outsail them. She's over Man the port. Stand by to haul to the wind. Then. We shall fight. Gunners, to your stations! Fire! We've got a howl from the team! But it wasn't enough. Prepare to be boarded! They're swarming over the side! Touch water! Who is that, Captain? The devil. I wish it well, Mr. Leganek. I wish it well. Yeah. Ah. 